Hi. Welcome to Portal 7. If you have installed a new SSD or HDD on your PC or laptop, then you must watch this video because I am going to tell you how you can migrate your entire data from your old system to a new SSD or HDD without installing any application and without changing your data. It will be very easy for you too. In this video, I will guide you how to migrate your Windows OS to a new drive without losing a single detail. For that I will use iSunshare Clone Go. It has three main features copy, backup and restore. With the help of Clone Go you can clone Windows OS or the entire disk to SSD or HDD without reinstallation. You can backup and restore system or partitions with no data loss. iSunshare Clone Go allows you to clone the contents of one disk or partition and move to another with no data loss. You can perform the same copies of a disk or partition safely. Besides, with the Windows OS backup, you can revert back to the lower version of Windows after upgrading to the higher version. You can create a backup archive for the selected partition with the SSD or HDD so that you will never worry about the data loss. Besides, you can restore the backup archive on any disk which has the enough space. You should pay attention that the destination disk will be formatted before restoration. With CloneGo, you can create the bootable Windows PE USB on any Windows computer within simple clicks. Besides, you can apply this USB to any Windows computer and enter WinPE to clone disk or partition data from your computer disk to external hard drive in a safer and faster mode. iSunshare Clone Go download link is in video's description and in pinned comment. You can download it and it has reasonable price just $20 for lifetime license. Once downloaded, go with the basic installation. It has simple and easy to use dashboard. In the upper window you can see your system's disks and partitions. Here I have 1TB HDD with 3 partitions and 500GB SSD as OS drive. At below you can choose source partition which you want to clone and target partition where you want to save. You can check and check target partition as boot disk. Here I will choose drive C as source which is OS partition and partition F as destination. Now click on start. It may take much or less time depends on your disk size. Here I have almost 52 GB data in my OS drive so it will take 5 to 7 minutes. Have patience and let it do its work. After finishing as we can see drive C and drive F has same data. Now I will close all open windows or programs. And let's restart system. Press boot key which is to change boot drive. In my PC it's F12 it may vary depends on your system manufacture. Here you can see boot options. Samsung SSD was my earlier boot drive. But at this time I will choose HDD as boot drive to test. If my disk is cloned or not.
As you can see it worked perfectly. You can see in this PC window it's on HDD now. SSD is hidden as it's not in use. Now let's check it's another feature which is backup. Here you can choose any partition or disk. For that you want to create backup file. Now select destination drive. Click on start. It may take much or less time depends on your data size. Have patience and let it do its work. As you can see backup file is ready with .icg suffix. Now click on restore. Select your backup file. Select your restoration destination. And click on start. Your data will be restored. Disk clone can be used to make entire disk copy. You can see all disks and partitions in upper window. Plug in a blank disk or you can choose an empty disk. Select source disk and target disk. And click on start, your disk will copy easily. Click on video's description link to download iSunshare Clone Go. To see more videos like this, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.